Some of the projects monitored are six blocks of completed classrooms at Owe Primary School in Ward 3 and another six blocks at Ewekme Community in Ward 9, both in Ikpobaoka local government area. The NAS member was also at China Moon Street, Ewabogun, to inspect the installed transformer ongoing three classroom block at Use Primary School and installation of streetlights at Ufuen Medical Stores Road, both in Igor local government area. The installation of light at Ogiso in Ikpobaoka local government area was not also left out. Out. The students and pupils of the schools came out to celebrate the member while residents where the projects are cited also expressed their joy. Judy said they heard the ego and the Pobaoka Federal Constituency Representative said he is satisfied so far with what was on the ground in all the places visited. The lawmaker assured that his zeal to uplift the people in his constituency won't be toyed with, hence he has gone out of his legislative way to provide both physical and human capital projects for them. Some of them are 100% completed, some are 75% and Others are still ongoing, so I think it's it's going well, and I'm very pleased with the work going on. The contractor to do a good job, and I'm very pleased with it. And I believe these communities will utilize these things and safeguard them for the betterment of the community. Some of the beneficiaries appreciated the national legislator Judy said there for fulfilling his electoral promises. How are you take out to give us light? So services with the suffer for light for this area. As your call, you give a new transformer. See, it's a good question. We thank God. I want to thank the honorable for the transformer. Mr. Isei, I want to appreciate him for what he has done in my school here. Uh, for giving us these uh, six classroom building uh, uh, rooms. I uh, want to say thank you to him. And for supplying chairs to us, to the classes, I want to say a very big thank you to him. Recently, the bill for a law to set up a federal agricultural institution in Ikbubaoka, initiated by the lawmaker Judy Saidehe, passed the second reading at the Great Chambers. Establishing a uh, federal university of agriculture in Oregon, Ikbubaoka, local government in Idaho State. The first reading was taken about uh, three weeks ago, and this is the second reading just passed through the second reading. The lawmaker has vowed not to relent until it go, and Ikbubaoka federal constituency is taken to the next level. Fosa Wangwe reporting.